Hi. At JRA, we like to talk about the numbers. We talk about the number of clients we serve, the number of volunteers we engage, and the number of boxes we deliver. Well, here are some interesting numbers about Amy. She has presided over 116 JRA distributions, 10 fundraising events, all fabulous, three offices, two warehouses, and she has raised over $7 million for JRA. <laughs> On a personal note, our JRA office family has some numbers of its own. Together, we have planned eight bar and bat mitzvahs, survived seven driver's license exams, <laughs> celebrated seven high school graduations, endured dozens of college applications, and responded to numerous urgent phone calls from our kids. We have been through a lot in the past 10 years. Amy has been our leader, our colleague, and our friend. I cannot think of many other people who can do what she does, planning fabulous fundraising events like tonight, writing detailed grant reports, cheering on a warehouse full of enthusiastic volunteers, driving a U-Haul truck, <laughs> and packing hundreds of food boxes, all while talking on the phone. Amy, your energy is boundless, and your enthusiasm is contagious. Over the years, as we have worked side by side, literally, you have been our chief decision maker and problem solver. You have been a cheerleader, volunteer greeter, box schlepper, and storyteller. You have been the champion of clients, a voice for the voiceless, and an advocate for the needy. You have worn many hats over the years, though, as we all know, you hate wearing hats, though the occasional crown is fine. And in addition to all of these things, you still remember to get the cake and decorate the office for everyone's birthday. For all this and so much more, we thank you, Amy, for all you have done for us and for JRA. We would like to present you with this tribute book, just a minute, containing contributions from the staff, the board, and the yellow cappers. We will miss you very much, but we know where to find you. Good luck in your next exciting adventure. Thank you all so much. For anyone who knows me, all right, all right. I'll tell a joke at my own expense. For anyone who knows me, I'm never at a loss for words, but I honestly and truly did not know this was happening, or I might have, I don't know, prepared something. Um, I want to say this from the bottom of my heart, thank you to my colleagues who have become my friends and are part of my family, I thank you. you guys, I, I don't know if I can say what an extraordinary opportunity it has been for me over the last 10 years. When it started 10 years ago, it was just me and Julie in the office. You can see that our staff has gotten a little bit bigger. Uh, to the board, to the volunteers, to our yellow cappers, uh, to tonight's honorees and our co-chairs, it has been an honor and a pleasure of epic proportions to have the opportunity to lead this organization over the last decade. Um, as I said on Sunday to about 1,400 volunteers who were there, I, I don't plan on being a stranger, and our next distribution is January 15th, and I hope to see you all there. Thank you all so, so much for being here tonight. Mm -hmm.